not gonna lie guys this week's update is pretty good because we have some uh, discounts on good stuff not just like shitty bullets and stuff <laughs> so let's go to the stables first and see what's new in there so right off the bat as you can see there is like a red thing attached to it That's, that means there's discounts and there's discounts on tech and services and as you can see there's discounts on saddles so if you guys didn't know which saddle is the best one this is the absolute best one it's called the nacho cheese saddle whatever that's called the nacho cheese saddle is what we call it me and my friends um, I stole the joke by the way from my friend <laughs> as you can see the regen rate is plus 20 percent and if you have uh, if you buy this saddle it will give you like an extra yellow bar and extra yellow bar on the speed and acceleration so it makes your horse even faster if you guys didn't know so uh, I have this saddle attached to most of my horses it's the best one and we also have some discounts on some good horses so first we have the race horses the Nokota, the thoroughbred, American standard bread I like this one actually the one in blue so you can get this one just for 91 bucks and there are some uh, so there are some with good stats but they're they cost gold bars so if you have enough gold you can buy it my girl my girl has like thousand gold so she can easily buy all of these <laughs> so yeah pretty good horses and then we have the thoroughbred which is like a, which is like bigger in size so yeah the ones with gold bars they have more stats of course and then we have these four horses also one more thing i like about this update is there's like discounts on the best horses so if you guys didn't know misery foxtrotter is one of the best horses like all the high level players i've seen they'll have this horse like most of them will have this horse and this is the norfolk roadster one of my favorite horses it's the moonshine uh, level 20 moonshiner horse and this one's the Glad Ruber. This is the level 20 trader horse. This one's good for PvP actually. Uh, if you if you combine this with the saddle I showed you in the beginning of the video, you'll get like full stamina and full health. So it can be really good for PvP. This one's the Creolo. This one has the same stats as the Arabian, so it's pretty good. And the Breton. In my opinion, the Breton is the best balanced horse in the game. And there's the Turkoman. I have no idea. I've never used the Turkoman before. And I've never used the Mustang either. So that's it for the horses. Now let's move on to the clothing section and see what's new in there. So here we have the Preto Poncho, which is back in stock. This one costs six gold bars. I might buy the dark blue one. Um, that's the only one that caught my eye. This one's mm, this one's the porter jacket. Looks pretty decent, nothing special. Let's see the prices. Hey now. I like this one. I might buy this one actually. The one that costs gold. But as you guys can see I'm running short on gold. I'm I only have five hundred and thirty nine guys, so I can't afford to spend gold <laughs> on junk. I mean not junk, it looks nice. So sorry rockstar <laughs> so that's it for the jacket and let's see what else do we have we have the this one looks sweet the charo jacket yep i'm definitely gonna buy this one whenever i see something with red and black it like catches my eye so I just i just can't ignore it so definitely going to buy this one and let's see what else is new so we also have the concho pants which are back in stock now don't be bare feet like me i was only bare feet because i selected no outfit and it wouldn't let me try out the new stuff so yeah it's it's pretty good looking and it's it's cheap guys it's just like 50 bucks so it's good it has some good designs on it i think that's it for the clothing section because i haven't seen any I don't know why I was looking at this. Look like a male stripper. <laughs> Anyways, let's go to the gunsmith and see what's new in there. So over at the gunsmith, we have the Carbo double bandolier back in stock. I I actually have a better looking bandolier that 
only cost the money, not even gold. So, for some reason, if you guys like this, go for it. No one's stopping you. Again, my my girl will probably buy it. See, she has like thousand gold bars, like I said. <laughs> so yeah, that's it for uh, the gunsmith. Let's and there is a new PVP series. So let's try that out. Okay, guys. So this is my favorite part of this weekly update. There is this special variation for the up in smoke and I forgot what the other one was called basically you carry the bags and deliver it to your home home base and the good thing about this special variation is that there is no snipers there is no rifles there is no repeaters so you can that so there's no like, the rapid fire crap so all the nerds use that these days <laughs> so if you want some good run and gun action you'll like this because you, you'll start up with throwing nice but you can pick up shotguns uh, double barrel shotguns sort of shotguns and I believe those two and the pump action yep so those three shotguns and throwing knives as you can see right there so it's pretty good in my opinion uh, I'll definitely be playing this one uh, I haven't uh, I haven't played PvP for so long because it's kind of ruined at the moment but I'll definitely play this variation because I like it I played like three matches and it's already addicted to it so yeah it's pretty good anyways that's it for now I'll see you guys next time